वेलकम टू हाउ टू सॉल्व दिस इक्वेशन फॉर एक्स एंड वाई एक्स क्यूब माइनस वाई क्यूब इज इक्वल टू नाइंटी वन वी हैव डिफरेंस ऑफ टू क्यूब्स हेयर एंड अकॉर्डिंग टू अल्जेब्रिक आइडेंटिटी एक्स क्यूब माइनस वाई क्यूब इज इक्वल टू एक्स माइनस वाई टाइम एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस एक्स वाई प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर इज इक्वल टू and this 91 can be factorized as 1 times 91 7 times 13 13 times 7 and 91 times 1 now you can see that x cube minus y cube is equal to a positive number so this number x cube is greater than this number y cube x cube is greater than y cube and x is greater than y so this expression x square plus xy plus y square is greater than this expression x minus y it means this expression x minus y is smaller than this expression x square plus xy plus y square so we select these two cases only 1 times 91 and 7 times 13 because this one is smaller than this 91 and this 7 is smaller than this 13 so we solve for 1 times 91 and 7 times 13 first we solve this case 1 time 91 we factorize this 91 as 1 times 91 now from here this is smaller factor x minus y is equal to this smaller factor 1 and this greater factor x square plus xy plus y square is equal to this greater factor 91 x minus y is equal to 1 we name this equation 1 and x square plus xy plus y square is equal to this greater factor 91 we name this equation 2 now we solve this equation equation 2 x square we can write this plus xy as plus 3xy minus 2xy plus this y square y square is equal to 91 now we combine this x square and these two terms minus 2xy plus y square to make a perfect square x square minus 2xy plus y square plus this 3xy 3xy is equal to 91 next this x square minus 2xy plus y square is equal to x minus y whole square plus 3xy is equal to 91 now here we put the value of x minus y 1 from here value of x minus y is 1 and 1 square is equal to 1 plus 3xy is equal to 91 next we move this one to the right side 3xy is equal to 91 minus 1 3xy is equal to 90 and if we divide both sides by 3 we get the value of xy is equal to 30 we name this equation 3 now in this equation we put the value of x from equation 1 x minus y is equal to 1 implies x is equal to 1 plus y so here we put the value of x 1 plus y times this y is equal to 30 next y times y y square and y times 1 plus y we move this positive 30 to the left side it becomes negative 30 is equal to 0 next y square we can write this plus y as plus 
सिक्स वाई माइनस फाइव वाई माइनस थर्टी इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड फ्रॉम दिस टू टर्म्स वी कैन टेक वाई एज कॉमन टाइम्स इन ब्रैकेट लेफ्ट वाई प्लस सिक्स एंड फ्रॉम दिस टू टर्म्स वी कैन टेक माइनस फाइव एज कॉमन टाइम्स इन ब्रैकेट लेफ्ट वाई प्लस सिक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो and from here we can take y plus 6 as common y plus 6 as common and in bracket left this y and this minus 5 y minus 5 is equal to 0 now from here either y plus 6 is equal to 0 or y minus 5 is equal to 0 from here y is equal to negative 6 and from here y is equal to 5 now to find the values of x we put these values of y in this equation x is equal to 1 plus y we have x is equal to 1 plus y first in this equation we put the value of y negative 6 x is equal to 1 minus 6 and from here x is equal to minus 5 and if we put the value of y 5 in this equation then x is equal to 1 plus 5 from here x is equal to 6 so we have two sets of solution here x is equal to 6 y is equal to 5 and x is equal to negative 5 and y is equal to negative 6 x comma y is equal to minus 5 comma minus 6 and 6 comma 5 these are the two solutions for case 1 now we solve second case that is 7 times 13 now we write this expression x minus y times x square plus xy plus y square is equal to 7 times 13 x minus y times x square plus xy plus y square is equal to 7 times 13 now we write this smaller factor x minus y equal to this smaller factor 7 and this greater factor x square plus xy plus y square equal to this greater factor 13 x minus y is equal to 7 we name this equation 1 and x square plus xy plus y square is equal to this greater factor 13 we name this equation 2 now we solve this equation 2 x square we can write this plus xy as plus 3xy minus 2xy plus y square is equal to 13 and we combine this x square and these two terms minus 2xy plus y square to make it a perfect square x square minus 2xy plus y square plus this 3xy 3xy is equal to 13 next this x square minus 2xy plus y square can be written as x minus y whole square plus 3xy is equal to 13 and here in place of this x minus y we put the value of x minus y 7 from here value of x minus y 7 square plus 3xy is equal to 13 next 7 square is 49 plus 3xy is equal to 13 and we move this 49 to the right side 3xy is equal to 13 minus 
49 3x y is equal to 13 minus 49 is minus 36 and if we divide both sides by 3 we get the value of x y is equal to negative 12 we name it equation 3 and in this equation we put the value of x from equation 1 x minus y is equal to 7 this implies x is equal to 7 plus y here we put the value of x 7 plus y time this y is equal to minus 12 next y times y y square and y times 7 plus 7 y and we move this negative 12 to the left side plus 12 is equal to 0 next y square we can write this plus 7 y as plus 3 y plus 4 y plus 12 is equal to 0 from y square plus 3 y we can take y as common y as common times in bracket left y plus 3 and plus 4 y plus 12 we can take plus 4 as common 4 as common times in bracket left y plus 3 is equal to 0 and from here we can take y plus 3 as common y plus 3 as common and in bracket left this y and this plus 4 y plus 4 is equal to 0 and from here if we put y plus 3 equal to 0 y is equal to negative 3 and if we put y plus 4 equal to 0 y is equal to negative 4 and to find the values of x we put these values of y in this equation x is equal to 7 plus y we have x is equal to 7 plus y if we put the value of y negative 3 in this equation then x is equal to 7 minus 3 and from here x is equal to 4 and if we put the value of y negative 4 in this equation then x is equal to 7 minus 4 and x is equal to 3 so we have the value of x 3 and value of y negative 4 and value of x 4 and value of y negative 3 here we have two sets of solutions x comma y is equal to 4 comma negative 3 and 3 comma negative 4 